Well, loads and loads of people have asked and I've finally been able to get enough collated together to give you a good top five stoves. Please like and subscribe. Okay, so we're gonna run through the best all-rounder, the best for overnight, the best entry-level stove, the one with the best fuel economy, and the most easy to use, the best user-friendly stove. The best all-rounder had to be the Heta Inspire 45. If you want to watch the review to this stove, just click on the card above. This stove was fantastic. It runs overnight with pretty much any fuel. It runs beautifully clean. The engineering is superb. It's got a stay cool handle. It really was a winner in so many ways. Well, for overnight running, there was a bit of a short list and it started with the Heta Inspire again. There was also the Burley that we tested. The Aduro 16 also performed superbly. And the Dean Forge Croft, which has had some tweaks to it, but even the new model is good at running overnight. The old model that I tested was obviously superb. But the winner overall is the Heta Ambition. This stove is very focused on burning just wood has no grate, no ash pan, which doesn't make it suitable for everyone. But if you're wanting to get wood to burn overnight, this stove ran for hours and hours and hours. I've gone a bit pro Heta, um, but the best for entry level stove uh, was the Saltfire ST1 Vision. This is a stove that you can still, even in the current climate, get for just over £600. Uh, and it performed really well. If you want to see the review of my ST1 Vision, just click on the card here. The most economic stove. This is a tricky one because you've got to take into account price, fuel economy, um, what the parts cost, how, you know, do they break, you know. There, there's a lot to this. But um, uh, you will already know that I'm a fan of the Hunter Herald Allure stove and it won our 2021 stove of the, stove of the year. And uh, it's won this one as well. Price is still really reasonable. The stove works superbly. It's economic to run. It's, uh, it, you know, spares are available and they're not expensive and easy to come by. It, is the genuine winner for the most overall best bang for your buck is the Hunter Herald the Law. And finally, our top stove for general ease of use. So this will take into account uh, ease of lighting, uh, controlling the stove, sweeping the stove, servicing the stove, um, all those sorts of things went to the Aduro 16. It was a dream stove to light uh, and the controllability of it was also excellent. It had an ash pan which made it really easy to clear out despite being super controllable and designed for wood. Um, the ease of lighting was fantastic and obviously that really clever air control that drawed itself in so you'd chuck a log on, open it up and it would draw itself in and slowly close itself down. It was a fantastically easy stove to use.